Good afternoon, YouTube, and welcome to That's Fucking Nice, where I do random reviews on anything under the sun. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos, and if my language offends you and you're just all around a snowflake, please get the fuck out of here. Viewer discretion is advised. Yeah, I'll tell you. Anyways, so let's start with what my buddy's giving me to try today. So I'm at one of my favorite places, Gold's Gym. About, about to do a big workout and he said I have a new pre-workout for you and I want you to review it I said okay let's take a look so he's giving me a couple samples in this thing and I can already tell I'm not gonna like it 50 servings muscle prime I did some research it's like $20 for 50 servings so you can already tell it's not gonna be good and uh, I don't feel like reading what's in all this but you can always look it up see what you think so let's go in for the review Take off my awesome pit vipers and let's take a look what we're up against. He says you gotta dry scoop it too, don't mix it. So we'll see. So already it smells like vomit. <coughs> with a hint of uh with a hint of berries and chalk. So really no. But I, I personally like uh, Impact Igniter Blue Raspberry. That's a solid 10. That shit hits hard. And you can literally drink it like it's a juice. You can already tell this is going to be nasty. So he says take two scoops. So we're going to start with one. Let's just see. Okay. You know when you eat like uh, pasta or something and, or pizza and you do a cartwheel or fall down or something and or you bend down and like it wants to come back up, uh, gross pukey taste, that's what this is. That plus <coughs> Red Bull, it's kind of like a mix. Let's go on for the second review. Hey, round two can't be as, as bad as round one, right? Bombs up. Okay. Mm, mm -mm. That tasted like a pack of Sour Batch Kids <coughs> that were drenched in garbage water. This is a no-go. That shit's nasty. Like, I'm going to go in and hit the heavy bag and do some boxing. Let me tell you, I'm not excited. Like, I mean, I can't really give a review on its effects yet. I could do that later. I, I don't fucking know. Um, shit's nasty. Generally, I'd say that's fucking nice. No, that's fucking wrong. No. It tastes like shit, but I will say he that he is a, a pretty jacked bodybuilder and he swears by it. So you know what? I can't give it a low review on its performance because, like I said, the guy is juiced to the nines and he loves the stuff. So he says, you know, for fifty bucks or not fifty bucks, twenty servings. No shit, twenty dollars for fifty servings. I mean. And you can't go wrong with the price. So honestly, price point for the amount of servings, you're going to get a 10, right? And I did read some of the ingredients. Some of the ingredients are what's in my Impact Igniter. So I guess ingredients-wise, for the price, it's it's up there. But for taste, fuck me, a 1? I don't even know. Like, that's that's bad. That's that's bad taste. Um, and, like, I've had some shitty pre-workouts back in the day. Like, 1MR tasted like fucking garbage. It worked. It just tasted like absolute shit. This stuff, like I say, it was like chalk, garbage water, Sour Patch Kids, re like vomit, shit. Um, so I can't even really give it a proper rating because, you know, it performs well from what I understand. After you wait like the 20, 30 minutes to let it kind of work its way into your system. But, 
Yeah, I'm just going to give this review based on flavor. Flavor and affordability. So let's combine the both, right? Let's give it a six. Because for the affordability, good flavor shit. Maybe if the flavor was good and it was affordable, I could give it a higher rating. But no, no that's bad. That's yuck. Anyways, you guys all have a good day. Oh.